thinking if they win this, the winners of this are gonna head on out too. Can you give me a one? Whoops. One, <laughs> be. Well, look okay, let's going into game one. I love the music choice. Oh, so this happy. music is very, very relaxing, very, very chill, laid back. Um, right now we're gonna see classic Palutena nail nail up up there. Up. And that already Mr. E is off stage. Well, look at this. Um, oh, he tried to teleport cancel to get back to ledge. Back. Oh no, he's just right in there. He's off stage again. And right now, ooh, I love the patience from Frozen. Ready to back out him, calling out the goal. And I feel like Palutena's back out just does so much work in ledge trap. And of course, having invulnerability, at least intangibility. Yeah. That's the first time I've seen Frozen counter. <laughs> And right now, like, Frozen, I feel like this is how a lot of sets with Frozen go, where he just keeps so much of the game on ledge. He just keeps them off the stage for, for so, so long. But right now, the sides have flipped. Um, you see Mr. E being in the one ledge trapping, but the back throw yeah. enough to take out the stock. Frozen sitting at a very comfortable, was at a very comfortable 88%, but already at uh, seeing a kill percent for sure. Eric's also really good at, at ledge. So... I feel like this game is not going to be much of stage with most of ledge. Like, that's how they're going to get most of their damage and stocks. Ooh, an interesting jump for Mr. E, just like maybe ready to react, putting yeah. himself in a position able to react and punish uh, any of uh, Frozen's getup options. But right now, he's just keeping him in the corners that's in the neutral area, not enough to take out the stock quite yet. But he's just keeping him there in that's the F tilt. Yeah. Yep, more than enough. Fantastic ledge trapping from Mr. E. Super, super good. And oh, right. This is the grab. Hot dodge right through it. Oh, he has no jump. Oh, he. He tried to react to the grab, but it was a little too late. Yep. <laughs> and it just, it's just really entertaining to me, just like how much of the set is actually being played on ledge like this. Yeah, and we've, we've barely seen any stage, mm -hmm. stage game, oh, except now. But now it's back on ledge. Like both of these characters, like they don't, they're not particularly known for their low percent kills. They both earn their ledge traps, right? It has to be like a lot of reactionary, just a lot of thought, you know, a lot of thinking involved with it. But <laughs> both of them have just been like keeping, just like taking turns of throwing each other off, and then keeping them off that way. Ooh, maybe trying to go for the teleport cancel, maybe just landing on top there. Um, regardless, down the throw. down throw back into air. back air. Wow. I'm surprised you got hit by that. That was really bad DI, actually. He died at like 80. It's possible that he DI'd the wrong way because he was expecting a forward throw. Maybe trying to DI oh. in and up. Perpendicular to the angle that forward throws. He the first hit. He missed the second one. That was tragic. Huh. I know. And regardless, right now we're gonna be seeing Frozen for the first time in the set using neutral beam. Um, just like maybe trying to mix up the momentum for Mr. E, making sure that he's staying on his toes and definitely just like not sleeping on Palutena at the long range. And both of them just like playing footsies. And I love that patience from Frozen. Yeah, he, was like, he, he waited for the spot dodge. You were like, You're gonna hit my shield, big boy? You're gonna do it? <laughs> oh, buddy, you're gonna spot dodge too. And I was able to get the grab and throw him off the stage for that. I feel like both of these players are. Not scared to commit, but they're they're playing really patient. They're not one mm -hmm. of them like one of them's not committing to anything and waiting they both, for It's each not other that they're playing approach. passively, right? Yeah. They're like playing passive aggressively. In a way. Like they're both positioning themselves in such ways where they can properly react and, and punish or at least read and punish to anything oh. that the other person commits to. Wasn't that ledge again? That was a good way to get off. Ooh, and he's gonna down go for throw. the down is he throw. Go for up smash? Oh, he is. Wow, that up smash yeah. is so ridiculously active. Um, I feel like the play, the I mean, it was a coin flip, right? Because if he died, if, if he, he teched out, 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 then could have been a back hit. Yeah. Um, coming up. Um, but yeah, regardless, like I feel like it's so difficult to even say like what these players could be doing differently because they're both so ironclad in their fundamentals, especially in their ledge trap, in their respective ledge trapping, where 
they're losing based on the really, really tiny differences in their play. I feel like their play here was almost impeccable. Uh, I feel like at least Mr. E, from what I've seen, can just be a little bit less hasty to throw out those defensive options like spot dodge after hitting Frozen Shield. Frozen choosing Unova. That's an interesting yeah, choice. considering he's a Palutena. I'm not sure how he's well, going no, no. like, to Well, no, no, Frozen won, so he, he banned. Oh. That's what Mr. E Oh, chose. I thought... Oh, wait, yeah. Oh, I'm bad. He didn't want to opt for any of the flat stages. I'm surprised... Mr. E wouldn't pick, like, a smaller stage. Because, like, now, Eric's forced to approach. Paolo could yeah. just sit back like that. Frozen's just going to play the really patient and wait for Eric to approach. Ooh, I really love... I mean, Palutena and of course all teleport recoveries on Unova yeah. is very, very difficult because you can't recover low. I love the fact that he just went to recover right to the middle of the stage, just ignore the whole ledge trapping process entirely. You know, he just said, I'm going to reset neutral, I'm going to put you in, in disadvantage, I'm going to ledge trap you as fast as possible. I love the neutral, it was so, so active. I'm just covering almost oh no, all the... Don't jump <gasps> I don't know what that was. I don't. That was a little. That wasn't my cup that of tea. That was so. I think Frozen was expecting the back. Oh, it's another. Eric missed his up and went for a back air. And you'll see Palutena is like committing to down smash for for quite a bit. That was, Ooh. That was so good. You'll see Palutena is committing to like the down smash and the up smash because like for the down smash he's able to low profile surprisingly on so many hits and the F smash. Um, the win box on it is nuts. It's it's ridiculous. <gasps> wow, I'm surprised that Mr. E had enough invulnerability to just go through the entirety of Explosive Flame, but that just shows off how much matchup experience he has. Oh, that was... I'm not sure if that was probably a misinput, but he's kind of bad for it. And again, a again. great down throw into yeah. a back air. Did he miss his tech on the platform? No, he, he just straight up got hit by back air. He didn't get a chance to tech. And like Mr. E just like opting him to like keep him off stage right now. Yeah. And the neutral will be catching Mr. E sleeping. You have to be super like emotionally present just to make sure you're not getting hit with those long range projectiles like that. And now Frozen is gonna be the one forced to get in because Eric has a percent lead. Eric doesn't really have to approach now. And this whole game has been Mr. E at ledge versus Frozen. Frozen's just getting, like, Frozen's really good at getting off ledge versus Eric. Maybe another stock. Oh no. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Close for I mean, another one. I'm, I get scared anytime Frozen does that. Cause, I oh feel no, like he's, he's Lucina dead? has the ability. Oh, uh, I love the fact that Frozen saved his jump and able to just maneuver around that little lip of the stage there. But I'm pretty sure that Mr. E might be able to get a much harder punish out of that by like throwing out a neutral B. Or could that extend his hurt box in such a way that he would trade and then as a result die? That's a question that I certainly have for this. Now, Eric's just gonna try to get as, as much extra credit as he can from the stock. Mm -hmm. That's not When the back throw, not enough to take it. I feel like if you ran off with the neutral A, you would have had. <gasps> Great he use of the wind box. He wasn't gonna make it back either way. Mm, I don't know. I feel like he might have had enough momentum to drift and snap to the left side. Um, well, regardless, no Renos Frozen needs to come back. Great awareness for Mr. E, but had he back here, that would have been the stock and thus the oh, game. No. <gasps> I didn't know. That was such a strong commitment, but Mr. E, like, sitting very, very comfortable at his percentage right now. Wow, I've never seen a Palutena just oh be no, able to shoot no Oh, oh. he went for it. Is that it? Yep. Yeah, he had to buffer the ledge option or else he'd just get trumped into death like that. Uh, Lucina's back at recovering so much off the trump. Uh, Mr. E taking this to a game three. Um... Well, I, I, we're definitely not going to get to run back to Genova. This is a, not a, such a great yeah, stage not. for, um, this is not a f good stage at all for, um, for Palutena, I think. Just because it's like limiting the recovery options so much. Um, they ran back to PS2. Oh. After game one, they went Battlefield. 
Oh, they won game one. They went battlefield. Okay. Um, PS2 is interesting. Um, I feel like PS2 benefits Palace slightly more, but it's otherwise it's completely even. Well, right now, like Mr. E taking the lead already within the first 15 seconds, just pushing him off stage. I love that awareness and patience for Mr. E landing as soon as possible, uh, ready to shield the explosive flame, making sure he wasn't going to get hit with any funny business. And, and uh, Mr. E just applying so much shield pressure with the down tilt uh, on it. Like, just basically saying, hey, listen, if you're going to jump out, if you're going to go in, I'm still covering all of those options. It's like keeping frozen on his toes with that. Um, wow, it's just crazy how, like, difficult it is to get off the state, off, like, off ledge against both of these characters. They're both doing, like, such amazing jobs just keeping each other off. But I feel like game two and game three, Mr. Lee has been doing a much better job in keeping the opponent out. Um... Frozen might need to be a little bit more patient, like maybe not committing to those F smashes as he was doing before. And wow, the Florida trading with Mr. E's Florida. Yeah, Definitely not expecting that Mr. E could have spaced that a little bit back up to make sure that he would just speed out Frozen rather than actually trade with him. It's really even right now, actually. Up. Ooh, catching the jump out of shield with the up tilt more than enough to take out the stock at 159%. Oh, that's a funny shot. And slowly but surely, Mr. B is building up a lead for himself. Yeah. I get a lot of percent off. Up there, up there. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> god. I don't even know if I was that was a two flame, that. but regardless, Mr. E closing out that stock and suddenly the gap between him and Frozen has become a mile and the down throw into up air of bread and butter dealing 16, 26% already. Yeah. 42, wow. X has been in control this whole entire game. Oh, <gasps> is that? I actually think he's dead. I think that's it. I think that's it. I think that's, yep. I think he's dead. Oh. Uh, going for the controller disconnect. Um, GG's. That's a GG. That's a, that's a, that's a GG. Um, that was so good for Mr. E. The whole set. He was conditioning Frozen to sit in his shield. He was conditioning Frozen to play around his shield like that. And then the reason why he didn't catch on to that sooner was intentional, right? Because he didn't want to, he didn't want to like let Frozen... Like be aware of his new shield, be right. I he wants to save it as like a last minute kind of thing. I think 